Hey, this is Tony Corville, head coach of the Cairn Grove Golden Bears. I think we had an exceptional summer. We call our summer workouts summer sacrifice because that's what you have to do in order to be good. Uh, we had about 90% attendance rate, which is awesome. Uh, the, the attitude and the kids' uh, willingness to get better was definitely there. A lot of, a lot of uh, energy and focused young men. Well, we're, uh, we've, we've got a young group on defense this year. We lost, uh, lost a senior leader at each level, senior DB, a senior linebacker, and a senior defensive lineman. Um, so we've, we've got a lot of young guys that have to step up this year. But uh, so far, it's going pretty well. Um, you know, everybody's kind of learning their responsibilities, and we've got some guys stepping up to be leaders, so we're hoping for a good season this year. Oh, absolutely. A, a tremendous loss for us. But it's a tremendous opportunity for Kevin, and we're proud for him. Uh, and you're right. Kevin, I mean, on the field, coaching with the kids was awesome. But it was the things off the field that he did for us. You know, he was a mentor to these young men, uh, a pillar of our community. Uh, just a, good, a bad loss or a good loss, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So we are, but I'm excited about the guy we got to replace him. Yeah, I was able to hire Gavin Peters, who was offensive coordinator uh, the last five years at, at uh, Canadian High School. And again, another uh, young, Enthusiastic coach. I think he's one of the best young uh, high school uh, assistant coaches in the area by far. Uh, he's another energetic guy that's uh, very knowledgeable and uh, he's very uh, enthusiastic. And the kids love him. Well, the, you know, you know, he coming from that Veer background. We're gonna you're gonna see that. You're gonna see some two back uh, Veer from us. The kids have uh, bought into it. They. Uh, you know, it was a little different from at first, but they've bought in, and uh, we're really uh, excited the way it's going. Well, that's from, from day one, even in the summertime. You know, we talk about attention to detail. There's no detail too small, because all these small details add up to one big thing. So it starts, starts with being there attended, being on time. And when you uh, have a purpose for that day, you know, every, we told them every day we want to be the best at getting better every day, and in all facets of our life. So that's what we preach on a daily basis. We, we got speed all over the place. We, we really do. You know, our track team was, uh, won a state championship. Now, we got a lot of sprinters, okay? But there wasn't no linebackers or DBs or defensive linemen on the track. But we got some speed. So I think overall team speed, I think we, some of the disadvantages, we're still young. Like Coach uh, mentioned, alluded to earlier, we're young. We only got three returning on the defense. They're young, but yet yeah, they're very athletic, and we're, you know, looking forward to see what they can do. On both sides of the ball, I think – we got some good leadership, though. Well, we, you know, and I know this is Coach speak, but we're just going to take one game at a time, one challenge at a time, and, and give it our best and find out, you know. I know one thing. I think when we walk off the field with a win or a loss, the opponent's going to know they were in a, in a fight. <laughs>